I just got home from a baby shower and as I am getting ready for the week, I am transitioning purses because I just have a purse that I like to use during the week and I thought it would be fun to show you what's in my bag because somebody at the party was like, how do you fit everything in your bag? And I often get this question during the work week because I just come in with like this tiny bag and I tell you how I do it or I'm going to tell you what's in my bag and it is milk not literal milk but that is the acronym for all the things that I need in my purse and beyond that I probably don't have it on me a moment to admire the origami futuristic gravy boat this is one of my favorite purses. So here we go. Breaking down what milk is. The M stands for money. Money, money, money. But I'm trying to be better about carrying cash money millionaires on me, even though cash is dead. I'll show you what my purse during the work week looks like. Everyone at work is also like, how do you fit everything that you need in that purse? So, but I do, and I'm gonna show you how. So this is my purse for the work week it's like a hand and a half and I swear to you it fits everything that I need so it just has these two compartments so cash money millionaires is the M of your milk the I is your ID so money ID the L stands for lip gloss. We're not gonna use this during the week, but love to carry this with me. So that goes in this nice, fun, empty compartment. And the K is keys. So I do everything in my power to travel as long as possible. And if I drove some futuristic car, I'm sure I wouldn't even need a, a car key, but literally, all I have is a car key. I installed the like, keyless entry into my house. It was the first thing that I set up when I moved in. Had keyless entry in my houses for like the last 10 years. Best thing ever. My key just lives in there. And that's it. That's all that's in here. Um, because we live in the era of hand sanitizers, um, I got these very cute, low profile, hand sanitizer so you know it's got to match your outfit leave it to me to make sure that my hand sanitizer matches my purse so that goes in there but outside of milk I don't carry anything else I don't find a need for it and and that's it milk money ID lip gloss keys and if you must hand sanitizer but now everywhere you go there's hand sanitizer you really don't need to carry that around but when I want to fit maybe something else in here, I've also found these just hand sanitizer wipes that can easily be low profile and kept there. And that's it. I'm trying to find another acronym so I can include a cell phone. Um, One thing I can't stand is when people have purses and they're like busting at the seams because you have stuffed it with so many items. So I really try to make sure that I'm not busting at the seams with my purse. And literally that was all that was in here is milk. So milk P, milk C doesn't work. We don't tend to forget our phones but that is how I travel light. And a teacher was recently sharing how having a big bag and carrying the world in it gives off this energy of lack. Like you have this belief that there's not enough. You need to carry the world with you. You don't trust that what you need will be available. And I couldn't agree with that more. And I haven't carried a big purse in a really long time. So when I heard that, it just further motivated me to keep traveling light and to keep traveling with only milk. 
Um, I do carry a lunch basket during the week, so that has my lunch in it, and I will share with you, it, it literally only has my lunch and a bottle of water, but I will share that I do carry this amazing tool with me in my lunch box. It is this brush, this tiny brush by The Laundress, and it's actually a stain removing brush. And this is magical. You just get a stain on something, you brush it out, no water, no um, soap needed. And I eat my lunch outside every day under a tree. And so, you know, sometimes it's like I'll get stuff on my jeans because the bench is dirty. I try to do everything in my power to not get myself dirty on my lunch. But this is the only thing that is in my lunchbox just in case. I hope you're inspired to travel lighter and to trust that wherever you go, it'll have exactly what you need so that you can get away from that living in lack. Love you guys. Have a wonderful Sunday and I hope you have a wonderful start to your week.